Are you a big fan of iWork? You know, pages, numbers, and Keynote? Well, if so, then you definitely want to check out the latest version, the latest update to iWork, which includes one big feature, and that feature is this, iCloud iCloud integration is now featured in iWork, and this allows you to sync all your devices with all your documents easily, efficiently. It really doesn't get any easier than this. Let me just show you how this works. If I create a document here on my iPod, let me just find a document here to create. Let's see. How about this? A thank you card. Thank you to all you readers out there, all you listeners, all you viewers, etc. cetera. Um, go back to documents. Now watch what happens on my iPhone. You'll see it update here momentarily, any day now. There we go. There is the thank you card and it updates with all my changes, all the latest changes, and they all stay in sync across all iOS devices, including the iPad, the iPhone, the iPod Touch, and you can even access these documents on your Mac. And I'm gonna show you how you can do that a little bit later. If you delete a document, guess what happens? The document goes away on all your devices just like that. Now, just to put iCloud under sort of a stress test, I'm gonna create multiple documents in quick succession. So I'm gonna create this modern letter. I'm gonna create another one here. Uh, I'm gonna create this one, create another one. You can see all the up arrows on those indicating that they are syncing or trying to upload, and there you go. You can see them already being created on my iPhone as I create them on my iPod Touch. So, they update pretty quickly. Uh, and this will sync on your iPad as well, like I was saying. Now watch what happens when you make a change to one of the documents. In this example, I'm going to update the picture to my own custom picture of my duck here. There is the duck, kind of zoomed in, you can't really see his face, but watch it sync with the iPod here in just a second. And you're gonna see it update. And you should see the picture of the little girl change into a duck. And five, four, three, two, one. There it goes. So that shows you the syncing. You can even edit documents. It doesn't just happen on creation, but the syncing happens when you edit documents as well. Now what happens when I duplicate a ton of different documents? Here I'm gonna duplicate seven documents at once. I'm just gonna hit the duplicate button and watch what happens. You see them all starting to sync and then watch what happens on the iPod. Just a few seconds, you'll see all the new documents created right there. All the copies. Super simple. Now, how does this work on the Mac? Well, it's not as cool admittedly on the Mac, but it is pretty nice. Now, it's limited on the Mac because you it doesn't actually integrate with the iWork apps themselves. You have to go to iCloud.com and actually download um, the synced version of your documents. And I'll show you this now. I'm creating a document on my iPhone and as you can see there, I have my ducky on the iPhone, and here is my document. Now, if I go back out here, and let's actually head over to my desktop. I'm gonna show you my Mac right now, and you can see it actually update here on iCloud.com. There is the document, and it'll sync just like it does between iPhone, iPod, and iPad. But the only problem with this is you can't actually edit documents from this view. You have to download them first, and then open them up in your iWork apps, your desktop apps that run on your Mac. So that's a little limitation right there. Uh, hopefully Apple will make it so that iCloud integrates directly with iWork on the Mac, the actual apps. But besides that, this is a definite step in the right direction and it's gonna free up a lot of the thought process behind creating documents. You'll be able to create them anywhere on your iOS devices, your iPad, your iPod, and your iPhone and also edit them on your Mac as well and vice versa. So it's gonna be really great once all of this comes together. I'm looking forward to your thoughts on iWork and the new iCloud integration. Let me know what you think in the comment section below, folks. This is Jeff with iDownloadBlog.